Good morning, my brothers and sisters. Today I'm going to speak to you about how to get through a so-called faith crisis. It has been brought to my attention that many of you are wavering in your testimony of me and other church leaders. Let me be clear. If you stray from following me, your family and their eternal souls are at stake. I am God's prophet on earth, and you disobey me at your peril. Here is what you must do to come back to the straight and narrow covenant path. Step one, stop masturbating and watching internet porn. No one who has a faith crisis does so for any other reason than their own personal sins. It is your fault that you lost your faith, not this church's fault. Joseph Smith was allowed to have sex with his teenage housemaid behind his wife's back, but you're not allowed to look at naked woman on the internet. That's just how it is. Step two, pay more tithing. If you're already paying 10%, pay 20%, pay 30%. Pay more and more until your pitiful little testimony returns. Pray to God that he will save your soul while you work your minimum wage job and choose paying tithing to us over feeing your families. Step three, obey your church leaders. Come every single Saturday and vacuum my chapel floors scrub my chapel toilets. We eliminated the paid janitorial positions to save us a lot of money, and you are responsible for all of that now. Feel blessed if you are the only one who shows up to clean. Endure to the end. Step four. Finally, brothers and sisters, shun any family members who are causing you to doubt. If they say you can't afford to pay tithing, disconnect from them completely. If they say they have a problem with church history and that there's no evidence that Hebrew people lived in Central America 1,000 years before Columbus landed, shun them. Don't ever speak to them again. Your ward is your family. I, Russell M. Nelson, am your new dad. Bow down and worship me, brothers and sisters. If you follow these simple steps, you can have the promise that families will be together forever. Not your family, because you just disconnected from all of them, but some kind of family, you'll probably have many teenage plural brides or something. Stop asking us and just pay, pray, and obey. I say these things in the name of me, even the great Russell M. Nelson. Amen.